question. Um, this is a question from Michelle Dennis from Strathcona Baptist Girls School in Victoria. And she notes that she said, the life of a principal seems so intense. You know, the workload of a, of a principal seems so intense. So why do you do it? And how do you stay energized and sane? <laughs> uh, I think the one thing is looking after ourselves, our own well-being. But, you know, um, one of the things I've discovered being a principal is the collegiality. The collegiality is second to none in the teaching profession, whether you're a teacher or whether you're a principal, and I'm more so as a principal. You know, being a principal sometimes can be a lonely job because you're at the top and everyone comes to you for support and expecting you to put with the answers. Um, but the secret is that, you know, many principals don't have the answers and they rely on colleagues when something new comes up. You know, one of the saddest things that happened last week and I'm working through now, is that you know, we had a year two student that started at our school in kindergarten, and now they, this year she was in year two. She came to school on Wednesday and Thursday, and sadly she died. And it's been a harrowing experience for my staff, our school community, oh, my, myself. But there's no playbook in there for principal induction. What do you do when a student dies? Everyone's got like standoff operating procedures and things like that. But you know, throughout all my emails, I've been getting lots and lots of support from my local colleagues saying, look John, you know, if you need teachers to look after your, your students, we're happy to send teachers over. If you need anything, we're happy to do this. Please call us. Um, my director came here and spent a whole day, even did playground duty. You know, I think that highlights, you know, to me why New South Wales public education is a great place to work because of that collegiality. And that's at the extreme end. So at the non-extreme end, when we're talking about curriculum development or anything else, we can rely on our colleagues to share and collaborate and, you know, design together and grow and learn together and that's why I think as a principal that keeps me going because there's always a challenge there but as you talk to college you, you kind of immerse yourselves in more and more challenges and sometimes when some things we think oh we've done that it's old and whatever for many children we forget we're teaching children and for many of our teachers it's new.